So I have everything running. I have um, hopefully better light. Hopefully you can see it a bit cleaner. A bit cleaner, a bit clearer. And here I have I'm gonna folder on my device. For God's sake, don't open start. Pacemaker. So you know, it arrives as an email attachment, it looks like a file that doesn't it doesn't recognise. You open it. And not a valid pocket PC application. So it throws up a fake dialogue pretending that it's not valid and won't run. Press OK. And it does nothing until the system's reset. So for now, it is your system's completely safe until basically your battery next runs out unless you restart your device often. So you know you can see you can still go around, I can still active sync, you can still do all my stuff. Some browse pocket IE. Or Opera Mobile if I'm not insane. But when I reset, things aren't going to be the same. So if I grab it over and hit the little reset switch on the back. Come on. Voila. Hit the did in Windows XP not being happy because I just removed the device. And then it'll boot up. And once it boots up, it's not going to be too happy. I'm going to, while I'm here, untick it from PC. So as you can see now we've booted up, good things, what a lovely day it is today, it's unfortunate all good things must come to an end. So it's booted up, you press OK, and for a bit nothing appears to have happened. And now a payload's running. So now you can definitely tell that it's running payloads. See, my battery, I'm, I've currently got the thing plugged in, so how my battery is low is beyond me. See, it's currently charging. Also, the clock's ticking backwards. Now, a lot of these payloads I kind of need to point out and like show. After these, I generally don't. I don't know. This payload hasn't worked up until now, but there we go. There's Keemstar's face as your wallpaper. I don't know why, but this payload this is the only time that's actually worked. It does normally in the emulator, it's just on my device, I presume. I should open the battery low. And you can see it's drawing what you're gonna do all over the screen. Stand in line. 
Now you can see it's getting frantic. Now here's an effect I quite like of this. Because of the way scrolling works on these devices, if I open, say, the Windows folder, also it's trying to type a lot of, uh, a lot of letters. If I scroll... Oh, wait. I'm trying to show my thing off. If I scroll... It drags all of the other letters with it because of the way scrolling works. Of course that involves scrolling slowly, which is a bit more difficult to do than the programs are easier. So you can see if I scroll... Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
And there we go. So, it is done. So you can see if I lift this up so you get a bit better colour. It's dead. No buttons do anything. Not even power. All these are not functional at all. Only thing that works is reset. And that's that. Now it reboots, and then you can delete the shortcut, delete the EXE, and you're done. That's it. It's not particularly harmful in the grand scheme of things, mainly because I've disabled it so I don't screw up the device, but there we go.